guys, so in today's video, I'm going to show you how I achieved these faux locks. I'm going to show you how I braided my hair to get them to look like this, very natural. I went with this nice cool tone blonde that goes from a darker blonde to a lighter blonde. But um, these are the hairstyles that you can wear if you want to rock some faux locks. Wear it to the side, any side of your choosing, you know. I am totally in love with how this came out and it looks super, super cute. I'm going to be wearing this on my vacation, so yeah. And like I said, you can also wear it as a middle part. And my favorite of all the hairstyles would definitely have to be this up pony very very cute so uh, make sure you guys subscribe and like this video and let's get started so the first thing that you're gonna have to do is get your braiding pattern down what I did was just make some individual braids in the front of my head and towards the back I decided to do some cornrows because I want to uh, that part really isn't important so like I said I just did some cornrows and weaved a we weaving thread through it to secure them down I'm using this goddess locks I got this from my local beauty supply store and the color is right there it is M27 mixed with a lighter blonde so if you guys want to check that out I'll have it linked below and this is how it looks very very cute dark and then light during I guess towards the tips so first what you're going to do is usually I just take them out of the pack and you just start from the back so if you guys don't know how to do crochet you're gonna get a weaving needle you can buy this at your local beauty supply store on Amazon and there is a loop that you can pull the hair through and you're just gonna want to pull it tight making sure it's nice and secure just like that and you're gonna work your way up to the top portion of the braid just gonna repeat that over and over again so I'm gonna show you guys one more time how to do that you're going to pull the loop straight through under your braid that you just corn rolled and then the loop that comes through you're going to open it with your fingers and then you're gonna pull the other end of the crochet locks through that and then secure it tightly onto your braid. So yeah, that's pretty much it. So now I'm just gonna speed up this clip so you guys get a feel for what you have to do. So this is just gonna be the back portion of your head and um, you're gonna continue to do this. And then we're gonna move on to the front part, which are the individual braids. This, I don't know why I didn't record, but <laughs> I will show you the finished product. But usually what you're gonna do is you're going to loop the hair just like you did with the braids, but underneath the individual braid and pull it through. And it should look like this. So this is the final product. If you guys need more information on how to do individual crochet braids, I'll leave a video link for it down at the down bar, the one that I follow to get this look. But I hope you guys enjoy this video. Make sure to give this video a like and subscribe to my channel. And I will see you guys next time with a brand.